Hey guys, what is going on today? Today we got a brand new product we're going to be trying out here. It's brand new for 2015. A lot of you guys have asked about it. You all contacted me. Hey, go pick it up, man. Go pick this up. You guys know what it is. It's Barrett Jackson's Wash and Wax. They carry it at Walmart. It's actually a little bit more on the expensive side. I think it was around $9.50 US. And uh, so that's a little high. That's actually more expensive than McGuire's car washes and Mother's car washes and the Eagle One's car wash. So to me, if you're gonna charge me $9.50, you're gonna, I'm gonna hold you up to a very high standard here when it comes to this because I know those products are excellent, excellent. So I'm gonna like bring it in here close, let you see what it actually looks like. As you can see, we're gonna be testing it on my 370Z and uh, it's, it's love bug season. I just drive into Walmart, took it out today and I have like love bugs all over. See them? They're like flying around me as we speak and uh, they'll ruin your car's paint in two seconds. So you gotta get hurt and get it off. It says self-drying wash and wax. I apologize, it is a little bit breezy today, as you can see, but I just let you see the whole back of it. So this is out of Deerfield Beach, Florida, which is right there by um, Boca Raton, just south of West Palm, just giving you a heads up. And there you go, gentle street free wash. So we're gonna be testing it, like I said, here on my uh, 370Z. Hopefully the guys down the street won't be bringing their stupid lawnmowers down here. You can already hear the weed, weed whackers going, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and clean it up. It's not that bad off, I'll tell you that right now, and a lot of you guys are always bitching to me saying it's, it's it's uh, clean, but in reality, I can already see the dust. This car hadn't been driven in over three weeks, and that car wasn't driven in four weeks when I made the last video. So, to give you an idea of where we're at, but the front end has a lot of love bugs on it just from today driving up to the other Walmart. The, not my main one down here, but the other one, and it has love bugs already covering the whole grill. So, that's how fast they accumulate. So, just giving you a heads up. Let me go ahead and set it up, and then we'll uh, show you some suds, stuff like that, and we'll move on to the car wash stage. Stay by. All right, guys, here we go. We already have it all set up here. I've got my clean water bucket over here with my Griot's Garage mitt. Just letting you guys know, obviously, here's the product I used. And then my, uh, whatever, Auto Geek bucket, rolling bucket. This is where the actually suds are. Both of them, of course, have grit guards on it. All right, what I'm feeling for right now is I'm just doing this right now, feeling for lubricity. It's actually pretty decent lubricity here, guys. I'm going to give it a solid B+, plus, if not A- minus lubricity. This is actually pretty good. Not bad at all. Uh, even, a, yeah, solid A-, a minus here. No issues. It's, uh, it just gives you like almost an oily feeling between your fingers to give you an idea of what that uh, what the lubricity feels like. Uh, smell wise, the biggest thing right here. It has a good clean scent, a good clean scent. I can't describe the scent, but I just keep wanting to smell it some more, and I like that smell. So it's not bad at all. It's not like I don't know how to explain. It's not like flowers or any certain uh, you know scent that we know about like with other flower companies. But it's a good clean scent, and I do like that. So so far so good. Let's go ahead and uh, get everything done around. Let me spin around the camera real quick. I know the plane's flying over. You know where I live. And I'll show you what I was talking about with the love bugs. Here, can you see them now? Uh, remember, it's still on the tripod. You see these little buggers? They'll just tear up your paint so fast. See these things? They just get on your paint, they die like crazy. So if you don't know what love bugs are, they're a pain in the ass. You're gonna see them flying around me all day long while I'm washing the car. So that's why you gotta keep the car clean and keep the, whatchamacallit, uh, love bugs from getting it, otherwise it will literally eat your paint alive like it did to my mirrors and stuff on my blue car. I tried keeping it washed, but it just ate away after the years. All right, guys, stand by. Let me go ahead and uh, start prepping the car. The guy is, in fact, getting ready to mow next door. It's pissing me off, so I gotta hurry up and get this done, so stay tuned. All right, guys, what we've done now is we've done the top, we've done the front windshield, the back deck all the way down. I'm gonna work my way down here to the hood, just as usual. You can definitely hear the blower in the background. You know how it is, you know my luck. Nobody comes out during the weekdays. As soon as I decide to wash my car, they all show up. The last couple days have been uh, just uh, gray, rainy, and stuff like that. But during the days, it's been fine. Like I mowed my yard yesterday, and they always seem to just always come out as soon as I want to wash my car. I don't know what it is. So as you can well hear, they're down the street here. So far, though, it's not been too bad. Um, the product is good all around. I'm very, very sorry. He's right over there with the stupid blower. That's my, that's my life. Alright guys, welcome back. We're time for our final results here of the Barrett Jackson Wash and Wax. I went ahead and cleaned it all. As you saw, I had uh, no issues with it. Suds work there until the very end, which is a big thing in my book. 
Uh, also, another thing I want to comment on, the lubricity was very good all throughout. Uh, I had really had absolutely no issues with this wash. It, at $9.50, I would say it's, it's a bit overpriced compared to Meguiar's and some of those, but uh, it's right there in the ballpark. I would say this is literally a solid A, maybe A minus product. I don't really have any issues with it at all. Um, I'm going to take you around the car here in a minute here. And um, anyways, I'm going to take you around the car here in a minute. And then uh, we're going to show off the car here. But everything is fine. I still give it a solid A rating. You won't have any problem at all if you go ahead and decide to pick this thing up. And uh, no problem whatsoever. So let me go ahead and show you the bottle one last time. And then what I'll go ahead and do is um, I'll uh, come back here and uh, pick the tripod off it. So stand by. All right, let's take it off and show you the final results. All right, guys, here we go. Here we're going to do the final walk around real quick. I got the camera in my hand, obviously, and we'll see what we got. I don't know if you saw me there at the very end. I'm, I'm making fun of the people that literally just, they had a big van down the shit. I'll show you in a minute. And uh, that guy right there literally just uh, stopped right there in front of my house and just did this huge breakneck turn and then just like floored it again. I'm sure you could hear it in the background. But uh, yeah, no problems whatsoever with it. Obviously, it's a clean car. I uh, had suds the entire sing time I had it. The lubricity is good on this product. No issues whatsoever. I'd say a solid A to A minus all around great product Barrett Jackson it says you don't have to dry it just like there are other wheel products that you don't have to you know agitate the wheel product I'm not gonna go on that I'm gonna dry it anyways and I'm gonna advise you to always dry your car and uh, I don't know maybe we'll do a test one of these days but when it says that you don't have to dry it because it's spot free I'm, I'm sorry I'm not gonna take that chance so there you go guys I hope you really liked the video two thumbs up for me please if you enjoyed it uh, I know um, uh, everybody's been asking about this product, so I finally went and found it at a different Walmart and I went ahead and picked it up over there. So, uh, there you go. Anyways, there you go, some Delta flying in for you. Alright guys, let me go ahead and uh, wrap everything up. I hope you enjoyed the video, like I said, and I will see you guys at the very next video. Listen to them revving that thing up like dumbasses. Alright guys, take care.